In this video, I am going to show you how to create this reusable navigation bar in PenPort. If you look closer, you can see the navigation bar itself contains navigation items. This is one item and these are other items with interchangeable icons and text. So let's get started. First of all, create a board and give it a height of 64 pixels and I'll give it a width of 390 double click and rename it to navigation bar demo control D to duplicate and I'll make this navigation item on the item you need the name and the icon let's create the name and change the text now we need the icon let's go to this site and search for an icon you can copy this to the clipboard and directly paste it here Control v to paste it's already 24 by 24 what I'll do is make this a component and rename it as icon underscore home so basically we need to be able to swap these icons when it's home and when it's search and for other items so that's why we are making this a component similarly search for other icons and bring it here and make it a component I have this already set so I have the icons already made into components we need this we need the instance of this component this is a parent component I will make another one by duplicating control D so now you can see this is the child I'm taking it here inside the item and I'm gonna give this a flex layout and center it in the middle and give it a raw gap of around 4 pixels make sure you remove all the paddings now you have the navigation item let's make this into a component so that we can reuse it duplicate this so that we make a child a variant so this is the parent and this is the variant I'm putting this variant into the navigation bar demo and I will give this a layout of flex as well and make it centered and remove all the paddings if you see the navigation bar contains the navigation item let's make this 100% width now when I control D to duplicate this I will get another instance of the navigation item and I do once more and now you have four items so now control click on one item and double click or press T and you can change the text now 
now you can easily swap these icons select the component itself and then go here and instead of the icon home you can choose icon search and here you can use this watch later wish list and for settings you can use it use this so if we make any changes to the component it will reflect in all those areas so let's make this 14 you can see these changes as well i'll bring this back i'll remove the color from the navigation item but we have the color in the navigation bar let's keep it as white now what i'm going to do is make this another component so navigation bar is a component now Control d or duplicate now we have the child now you can drag it onto a screen like this So you can see we have created this component and if we make the global changes like change the color it will reflect in the child children as well so that's how you create a reusable navigation bar in penpot hope you learned something today thanks for watching